what this world needs. This world is searching for everything to be thought of. Yep. They're looking here. They're looking there. There's only really one place they need to look. Yes, Lord. Only one man they need to call upon. Mm -hmm. All things are possible. The book of Philippians says, I can do all things through Christ Amen. which strengthen me. So I'm not going to talk long. We have had a great loss in our church. I want to that today. Lord, that we have Brother John Burke has passed away and Brother Junior, he got what he wanted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He wanted to go home. Yeah, we do not know the arrangements yet. It appears now that it'll probably be around the middle of the week, about Wednesday. We're not saying that's for sure. But uh, I want you to remember that family. Remember all of this whole country. Remember our leaders in this country that they would turn to God for what we need. Remember, Brother Buddy, Carney. Thank you, Brother Very serious condition. I told Brother Marty, I, I love him. Yeah. I have an advantage over people. And that Brother Buddy, I know he loves me. I'm not saying that. I have an advantage over people that don't love me. I can still love them. Mm -hmm. And we're required to do so. Yeah. So we him. ask of you, any of you may see this, don't give us no glory and honor. No. Give it all to God. Amen. It belongs to Him. Amen. There's no way on earth, Brother Junior, that I could stand here when I'm blessed to preach to say the things that I say. Now, there's been times we haven't been blessed. But we ask you to receive this in the way that we send it out. We send it out with love. Amen. That's all it's for. The love of Jesus Christ and the love of people. Like I said, I've had people call me, but they really called from Texas, they called from Tennessee, they called from all over the country. How they appreciate this old time yep. preaching and singing. Now, is there anything on the mind of the brothers and sisters here? You remember Brenda Zane. Yes. Yep. Uh, and that Beverly. So that whole Beverly family. And, and the Beverly's passed away. And, uh, I don't know her age, but Marty, about how old was she? About in her 80s, she was she the in her 80s. Remember that family, and uh, I think the Randy says that they'll maybe move her to Rebecca Church tomorrow, if I'm not mistaken, and, yep. uh, and the funeral will be Monday. Please pray for that family. Pray for our Philadelphia brethren and have their association. Pray for them, that we love them, and we love everybody, and we want you to bless them. <coughs> Anything, nothing else on the mind of the brethren. I think we we would do well to probably just get us all have prayer and go from there. We have other brethren here with us today. We have plenty of preaching brothers here with us. And uh, so, you know, it, it doesn't matter to me who preaches. 
I've never had the preacher's itch. No. Amen. Now, I have a desire to preach, brother. I won't deny that. I wouldn't deny that, brother, Junior, for no man. I have a desire to preach. God's called. So anyway, if you brother got a song in your heart, we'd like you to sing it. And then we're going to have prayer. We'll go from there. And please, if you like these recordings, maybe soon we'll be able to start back church. I don't know. And if you like these recordings, please let us know. And, and uh, it makes us feel good to know that somebody needs this. Sing, brother. Sing, brother. Comfort them, Lord. 
through their trying times. Oh, Lord, would you please, would you please bless the sick, no matter where they are, no matter who they are. We don't care if they're black, brown, or white. Lord, we just want you to, to bless them, Lord, according to your will. Lord, dear God, would you bless Sister Genesis, daughter Renee, Lord, as she goes through her sicknesses and everything, Lord, that she's got to go through. And Lord, dear God, I ask you, please, dear Lord, would you just continue to bless this little church and keep it a, a, a growing and a going on, Lord, as long as you want us to be with you, Lord. Lord, dear God, would you bless the missing children, dear Lord. Would you bless the ones, Lord, that's trying to do your will, Lord. Just uphold them and help them, Lord, in every way. Dear God, would you bless all the sinners, Lord, that needs to come home to you. Would you give them another chance, Lord? I always ask you to give my children another chance, Lord. Maybe they would come to you before it's too late. Oh, dear sweet Jesus. I love you, Lord, because you first loved me. And I thank you, Lord, for my salvation. Lord, dear God, would you please get the leaders of this country, give them a mind, Lord, to do the right things. And the people, Lord, give them the right mind to push the old devil away. Try to, try to be good to one another here in this country, Lord. We love you, Lord. Love you so much, Lord. And I thank you, Lord, for everything that you do for us and the things that I failed to ask for, Lord, that need to be asked. Grant them according to your will, dear God. And I ask all these favors and these blessings in Jesus' sweet name. And amen. 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 Back here, let it, so he can. Yeah, yeah. That way he won't be turned around. Uh, yes. And it was a dark heart. 
Uh, but I couldn't deny that light that he shined down into my dark heart. And I began to ask and groan to him, oh, Lord, I've seen you. You've come to me before. Oh, and I've turned you away. Uh, but this time, Lord, I want you uh, to start leading me in my life. God bless him. If you don't have any children, oh, my Lord, uh, give up the things of this world. Uh, they're all temporal, and they're all going to melt away in fervent fire one of these days. Oh, uh, yes, yeah. uh, even the flesh, the very flesh that stands before you, it's going to go back to the dust one of these days. It's all temporal. Uh, but I've got a soul. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, yes, when Adam uh, was laying there, can you see it? Uh, my blessed Jesus, uh, God himself, uh, breathed into his nostrils. And there he became a living soul. Uh, that's what separates us uh, from the animals of this world. Uh, so let's act like it, children. Uh, let's put that soul and turn it over to the Lord. Uh, yes, how good he is. How good he's been to me. Oh, uh, yeah, I have nothing uh, to boast about in my life. I know what I can do. I can make a failure. Oh, but Lord, how mercy. How good he's been to me. Oh, uh, when he lifts me up and gives me a little bit of something to say uh, that may help another one along this life journey. Oh, Lord, I feel sick uh, that I can be a part of that family. Uh, that I can call heaven uh, my home one of these days. Oh, one of these days. I'm going to see him for myself. Uh, not enough. Uh, yeah, uh, this way's been going along uh, for many, many years. It goes back all the way to Jesus uh, when he brought grace upon this world. Uh, yeah, so how do we get back to heaven? I'll tell you how you get him back down in your heart. Uh, turn away from the things of this world. Uh, you can't serve them both. Uh, but turn your life over to him. And say, Lord, I let your will be done in my life. Amen. And see if he won't I give you the direction that you need. And take you by the hand. Oh, what a light he is in my life. If I didn't have him, you could just take me and do whatever you want to with me. I've said it before, just dig an old hole and throw me in. Because I wouldn't want to turn away. Yeah, you know, there's some out there probably wishing that this is the only world, but there's another one. Yeah. And that soul that I told you about, it's not temporal. It's going to go one way or another when this world is over. Yeah, and you better, if you have not, uh, begin to count up the cost I pay. Yeah. Now, why does it matter to me? Because God put a love down in my heart. And I care about every man and woman in this world. I don't, I don't like some things they do. But I love them, Brother Glenn. I love them regardless. Yeah. Uh, that seems impossible. Uh, when I used to want to get uh, back at them. Yeah, I used to want to get even. Uh, but I'll tell you what the Lord said. Uh, pray for them. If all you have uh, love the ones that love you, what have you gained? I want to gain the world. I want them to come our way and feel what I feel right down in my soul. Amen. And once you get it down in your soul, you will understand why brothers travel many miles Amen. and why we go and do the sisters prepare and take care of things the way they do because you care. And you love this old time way. Yeah. And you want it to go on. And you want others to enjoy it the same way that we're enjoying yeah. it now. Yes, sir. I don't know. There's, this world has got churches on every corner. But I, there's only one church. And that's the church of Jesus. Yes, sir. And if you walk in one and you can't feel it, i turn around and go out. Yes. But this is my home now. Hey, the little jewel church took you. me in and put their arms around me. And yet there's room, Mr. Brother. Yes, there this is. old gospel ship has been sailing on. And there's room for many more. Uh, God bless yes, you. Uh, and it'll sail on until he calls her to an end. 
And then it'll be over. Oh, yes. And how will it be? And when a tree is cut down, that's how it's going to be raised. How will it be with you and your condition? I hope you took time to count up the cost because it is the most sincere thing you could ever do in your life is to count up the cost and live yes. your life in a way that when this your life is over, we're seeing them go by every day. Brother John, wonderful brother, just a vapor upon the water, and he got to go down the stream quite a long way. Yes. Yet if you had asked, I'm sure he'd have felt like it was a short time. Yes. Been he was 90-some years old, 90 years old. Sister Annetta up at the Little Rebecca Church in her 80s. But then I see others in their 30s, 20s, babies. There's no promise Amen. of tomorrow, brother. <clears throat> so I just want to just put that on your heart. And I just seem to, when I get up, it seems like where my mind goes is for the world to turn. And yes, we are to feed the flock. Absolutely. But I believe if you are gaining naysayers, you're feeding the flock as well yes. because they can see them come home. Yes. yes, if there's any of that's out there, yes, you want to know the way of repentance. repentance. God is the way, and he will take you by the hand and lead you and guide you. Yes, is it, some of them are trying to say, just accept the Lord. Yes, I, I, if that could be done, that could be done, but that ain't the way I found it, brother. Amen. Just like Apostle Paul when he stood before the king. Oh, uh, yes. And he told him his experience. Yes, he preached to him his experience. And what did the king say? Thou almost persuaded me. Yes. But not quite. That's it's right. not just to hear, but it's the doer. Yes. You've got to do something about it. Amen. Yes, I can tell you all the day long how the Lord saved me. And how I felt when he did. Uh, but it. And you don't go down that road for yourself. Yeah. It's a little narrow path. Amen. Oh, yeah. Amen. And it'll lead you right up to heaven one of these yes. days. Oh, uh, yeah. There's a wide road I was on one time. And I know what's on her. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, there's this old Satan is on that road. Uh, just a beacon and banging me from pillar to post. And I couldn't be settled. I was all over the place. I'm trying oh, to make man. something of me. Uh, yeah, Lord. Uh, but when he put me on that little narrow path, I, I could feel him oh, around in my soul. Oh, yeah. How did he become a living soul in me? Oh, and now oh, he's leading me and guiding me all the way down to my life. And I want to trade him for all the riches in oh, oh, this world. Oh, oh, you can have it, brother. Oh, let me be an old poor beggar. Oh, yes, sir. I don't need anything in this world. I've got food. I've got baby. Oh, no wonder. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, we've never uh, uh, seen the seed of God uh, begging for That's bread, right. have we, brother? Uh, God will take care of his children. And I love him so much. I'm not going to take much time. Well, I know we've got well, plenty well. of brother here. Uh, but I'm real well, good at him. Uh, yeah. I just asked for a little crumb. Yeah. And oh, Lord, what does he give me? Just like when they gathered out on the hillside. Yeah, all they had was just a few little fish and a few loaves and 5,000 there. And what did the Lord do? He fed them all. Yes, sir. Yeah, he set them in little groups of 50, I believe, at a time. And he blessed that food. And what did they do? Uh, they ate and they took up baskets full. Oh, uh, yeah. Nothing is impossible with my Lord. And my Lord is going to take me home one of these days. Amen. I'm getting closer today uh, than I was yesterday. Yes, I know this man's getting older. I don't need to go to a class reunion to see I'm getting older. Amen. I'm getting older. And one of these days I'm going to be done. And then my race will be won. And I will call on him. And he will pick me up and answer. He will call my name. And I will answer him. Bless his holy name. Lord, children, if you don't have him, mm. get him. Get him. Yes. Get him right down in your heart. And then when you do that, do you just sit out there? No, come home. 
You'll never be satisfied. Come home and tell the brethren the good things. Yes. I don't believe the Lord will save anybody. So, and then just to leave them standing alone out in a field. He'll tell them where to go. And he'll take you by the hand and take you home. And you'll be happy. Yes. You'll be happy when you went and done what the Lord wanted you to do. I know the there's, it's not always easy. There's things I try to get out of in this world. But it seems like there's times when I make the most excuses. I told Patty, that seems to be the time that I need to go the most. Because old Satan is trying his best to get me to get rob me of joy. Amen. And get me to stay home. And get me to miss out. Yes. And get me not to go over there. They don't want you over there. They don't need you over there. That's exactly when we ought to go. Yes. Uh, yeah. And put a broom dry on Satan's head. Amen. I get sick of him sometimes. Yes. Look at And I'll watch how he does our children. Uh, twisting and turning them yes. all around. And I know what they're going through. Uh, but I can't get them to stop it. It's going to take them. And it's going to take the Lord uh, to get down into their heart. Yes. And then uh, one of those days open. In their eyes and let them see for themselves what they're missing out on and what they could have if they would turn it over to him. God bless you all. I love you. Just a few words. That's all. That's all required, I believe. I don't Amen. think it takes all day long, Amen. but I felt good here. Yeah. Bless you all. God bless these families <laughs> that are mourning. Yeah, what a God we serve when he said, blessed those that mourn, for they shall be comforted. Yes. That's enough right there to give him your life. It ain't yours anyway. It's his, and it'll be his all the way to eternity. Whatever you do with it, you better get close. Children, this time is running out, and I love you, and I want you all not only to go home to heaven, but I want to enjoy your right here in this world. I want to walk with you. I want to talk with you. Yeah. yeah, I want us to be in love right here. Yes. And we can be if we return to the Lord and let his will be done. God bless you. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. We continue to bless, Lord. We can. Love you, Brother Mark. Well, bless you. Bless my brother, Lord, I pray. Down in Gethsemane's garden, Jesus knelt there to pray. Father, let this cup pass from me, were the words he had to say. Let his disciples pray. back to see each time he found them sleeping could you not watch one hour with me yeah. his heart was heavy and burning he knew it would not be long that he would become our blood sacrifice and die on the cross all alone upon a stormy afternoon on a cross at Calvary Jesus died to save the world to set the captives free my Lord lay sleeping in the grip of death three days in a dark, lonely tomb. But on the resurrection morning, as a rose, Jesus did bloom. Uh -huh. Down in the seventies garden, Jesus knelt there to pray. Father, let this cup pass from me for the words he had to say. Down in the seventies garden, Jesus knelt there to pray. Mm -hmm. Yes. Lord help. Yes. I hope and pray just for a moment of time. Yes.
she's praying with you. Mm -hmm. They'll soon yes. come at a time that we right. won't gather here no more as we are now. Yeah, Lord. We're looking God bless. at a very dark and dreary world that we live mm -hmm. in. I study the book. I read and listen to the book. I do all these things, but I don't know all things. No. But I know that Christ is the Savior of the world. Yeah, Lord. But Brother Glenn, he's a special Savior to the yes, believer. Yes. As I was talking to Brother Glenn last night yes. about this, and I don't know whether Kay heard what I said, but I said there was a one special gift ever given to this world, the greatest gift of all, mm -hmm. was Jesus Christ. Yeah, Lord. I thought, you know, as Brother John passed away last night or around good. midnight, yeah. there's a time to die, but there's a time to be born. Yeah. There's a time to weep. Yep. There's a time for laughter. Yes. And there's a set time when Jesus is coming back. <clears throat> I don't know when that is, Brother Marty, but I know he's coming. Yep. Yeah. So I said, I don't believe that he's coming back. <clears throat> he's coming, brethren. Oh, yes. Bless him, Lord. We're just pray. as sure as I'm here. Yes. Well, brethren, today he's coming to get the church. He's going to take her home. He's going to present her to the Father. <laughs> And you know something, Brother Marty? That's the one that he died for. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I know that he died for the sin of the whole world. Yep. But when it's all said and done, those didn't take advantage of that, what he done for them. Mm -hmm. It better than Junior because they didn't believe. Somebody said, well, is that all there is to it? That's all I've ever seen, mm -hmm. believe, whether you're either a believer or a non-believer. Mm -hmm. I've never found it any other way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Understand, it's coming your time to die. Or what will you do when the death angel comes? Yeah. Well, Brother Marty, I've stood over them and heard them, Brother Junior, you and I have. But I want you to know that today we could be standing by when the, when the death angel comes. Uh, uh, we may not see it. Uh, uh, we won't hear. Uh, uh, the wings of them or whatever they come on uh, or the cloud by the junior to get them uh, but I want you to know uh, uh, that I believe they see them coming uh, and I've heard them say uh, oh Lord there's an old song by the junior that says uh, uh, come Lord oh quickly come uh, and take me home uh, uh, so therefore today uh, uh, when it comes down time to die uh, uh, Brother Keith, what will you begin yeah. to say? Yeah, uh, brother, uh, I want you to know, uh, uh, Brother Marty, uh, 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 that he died for the sin of the whole world. Oh, my brother, today, I want you to know uh, uh, that there's something uh, uh, that man must do uh, um, today. Uh, 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 what he must do, brother, uh, 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 he must believe upon uh, uh, Jesus Christ. Brother, yes, I must believe that he come here and that he died. Oh, brethren, he must believe that he hung on that old rugged cross. Yes. Brethren, uh, uh, who did he hang there for? Uh, Brother Marty, he hung there for every man yes, and Lord. every woman. Uh, uh, that would come into the world. Uh, 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 Brother Junior, they said, well, uh, uh, he didn't die for those under the law, uh, uh, but he did, brethren. Amen. Brother, Amen. Brother, today. Well, oh, brethren, today, I want you to know, Anthony, brethren, uh, uh, then, uh, when he come, brethren, uh, 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 I want you to know he had one thing in mind, brethren, uh, and that's all he had. Uh, uh, but when he went out, and I you to know that he had a natural body about him, but the Marty, <laughs> I, he had pain and he hurt and, and he was tempted in every form uh, that we would be tempted in. Yeah. Oh, brethren, uh, when he went out to pray, brother Lynn, uh, uh, somebody said uh, uh, today, he didn't dread the sting of death, brethren. 
uh, uh, but I want you to know uh, uh, that when he went out to pray, uh, uh, he began to pray, Father, let this cup pass from me. Uh, brother, uh, what was he talking about? Uh, uh, was he talking about the death on the cross? I know he wasn't. Uh, and then, uh, He was talking about uh, uh, that cup of sin. Uh, uh, brethren, uh, uh, here's what he said. Uh, it's most bitter, <coughs> brother Junior, uh, but it cannot pass by today. Uh, oh, my, as he hung on the cross today, uh, and he hung there. Uh, uh, I want you to know, uh, brother Junior and I talked about this the other night. Uh, uh, brother, uh, uh, when he died, uh, he said it's finished. Uh, is that what he said or not? Yes, sir. Uh, today. Oh, Brother Gwen, how do you know uh, that he died there? Uh, and, uh, and I want you to understand uh, that today he paid a price uh, that no man can pay. Uh, and uh, I want you to know uh, through this world, Brother Drew, I've been blessed to have uh, finances uh, and to be able to not starve and do all these things. Oh, but Brother Junior, when I come up to get salvation, I couldn't buy it. Amen. I couldn't pay for it. I couldn't do anything. Uh, um, uh, so uh, I tried to uh, do all these things, uh, uh, but I want you to know, oh, Brother Green, I cannot go to heaven without the Amen. No man ever can go mm -mm. without that. So he paid a price for my soul, and he paid a price for your soul. Thank the Lord. But I want you to know when he died on the cross today, he said, Father, Father, <laughs> why has thou forsaken me? Brother, oh, Brother Glenn, that was the worst thing that he ever faced. Brother, I believe that. He called his father, had to turn his back yeah. from him uh, uh, just for a moment of time and let him die. Uh, uh, today, uh, uh, somebody said, uh, uh, today, uh, uh, Brother Junior, we took the trip many years ago. Uh, I went down into Tennessee. Uh, uh, our brother brought us a picture, and we still got it hanging on the wall. Uh, today, oh, Brother, today, after he died, here's what they said. Surely this was, what well, brother? Surely this was the Son of God. Yes. Surely this was the Son of God. Uh, uh, why do they say what? Uh, they called Brother Junior. They thought he was dead, brother, uh, for eternity. Uh, uh, but I want you to know, he'd already prophesied. Uh, brother Marty, uh, and they, oh, you turn this temple down. And in three days, I'll run up again. Also, brethren, I'm going to close with this. There's a time to be born, and there's a time to die. There's a time for laughter. There's yeah. a time ah, for sadness, brethren. Yeah. Oh, but, but Junior, they say, well, there's any time I can get saved any time I want to. Mm -hmm. No, brethren, you no, can't. No, sir. No, brethren, you can't. Yeah, no, you can't That's do right. it. The Bible said, uh, Brother Glenn, I'm glad to hear the Bible said that no man could come unto me except my Father uh, which sent me draw him. And no man could come unto Father except that he come unto him by me. Amen. And here's what he said, Brethren. We're going to close with these brothers come. He said, I placed before you, Brother Junior, an open door. That's right. Yes. That's what the Bible said, Brother. Yes. I placed before you an open door. No man can close that door. It's kind of like the ark, Brother. Yep. When the door was closed, Brother, who could open it again? Yeah, it was amen. never going to be open no more. Amen. Never going to be open no more. But I'll tell you why. Those who got on the ark were, were saved, weren't they? That's right. yeah. They were saved. See, I learned to argue about this and argue about that. But the ones who got on the ark were saved. They're still an ark sailing, Brother Junior. Yeah, they're yeah, still yeah, an old yeah. ship sailing mm -hmm. today. And in that ship, there's safety. And you want to get on it, brethren. Amen. And the old, Bible, the old song says, she's only coming this way one time. Yeah. Brother. Yeah. That's it. It's going to be done. Yep. So may God bless you, keep you. All the listen to this. Lord. 
Let me tell you something. We're not here for exercise. We didn't come up here to make a big showing. No. But we come here for Jesus Christ. Amen. To preach him to be the way, the truth, and the life. Amen. And the only way, Brother Marty, from this from this God forsaken thing like yeah. world sometimes. Somebody said it ain't God forsaken. I'll tell you the Bible says, Brother Junior, the nation that turns its back against God. Yeah. What's he going to do, brother? Amen. He's going to turn from them, brother. Yes. Whether you want to hear it or not, it's the truth, brother. Yes. And this nation has turned from God. Yes. It yes. appears so. So may God bless you and keep you. And you, brother, come on. I want you to come on. I wanted to I wanted to come. I wasn't here last week, but I want one of you brethren to come. May God bless you and keep you. He will if you'll believe in what he's will be. There's plenty of time, brother. Yeah, we're time for both of them. You brother continue to pray. I'll not be up here long, I don't reckon, but we'll just have to see what the Lord has in store, Brother Marty. That's right. We step up here in faith, brother, believing that the Lord wants to, to, to bless us. And it's already been a good day, Sister Rita. I've already enjoyed the preaching that we've heard here today. It's been wonderful. I've felt that, Brother Junior, the Spirit of the Lord here. And I'm glad that God has blessed us to assemble, Sister, one more time. It may be the last time, Brother Marty, that we assemble like this. We don't know. But we've come here to preach the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ, Brother Terry. Not to be seen, but to lift up Jesus' name that he might be seen by an eye of faith by some lost man or some lost woman today. That they might hear the gospel of their Thank salvation, you, Sister Janice. It's the most precious thing in this world to be a Christian and to, to know right down in your heart brethren, what the God has done for you. and I, 25 years ago, I tasted of him, and I seen that he was good. <laughs> and I've never found anything any sweeter, Brother Jamie. Amen. And I live by faith every day. I was saved by faith, <laughs> brethren and sisters, and my the, the just, the scripture says, shall live by faith. And it's every day, brethren, that he gives us faith to, to believe, to continue, to keep right on a going. And to march and toward our home, Brother Terry. I believe there's a home for the children of God this morning. I sure do. And I'm glad to be a child of God and to know that he has given me a home that I'm going to that is in the heavens, not made by hands, Brother Marty, this morning or this evening. I hope you'll pray. Yeah, Lord. Uh, we, don't, we get up here and we don't have a thing in mind other than the Lord Jesus Christ. And we depend upon the Lord to guide us. And to direct us wherever he wants us to go. I've heard so many things here today that stirred up my pure mind. And y'all pray that the Lord will gather my thoughts in. And that he'll give us a spiritual mind to be able to preach. But this evening we've come, as I've said, to lift up the name of Jesus. And it is the only name given under heaven in which men must be saved. And he is, uh, he is alive today and he's alive forevermore. And if you've never come to know him in the pardon and remission of your sin, honey, listen, I want you to know as these brethren have preached that hell is going to be your home if you do not repent. Honey, listen, I want you to know that time and chance has happened to all, Brother Marty. And I believe that each one upon the earth has heard the voice of God and the Spirit of God speaking to them, letting them understand that there is a reality in God and that there is a Creator Brother Junior, that has created all things, brethren. And I want you to know that he has created everything for his glory this evening. This very world out here, Sister Janice, if you'll look with an eye of faith, you can see many beautiful things. Listen, he has placed Brother Glenn the stars in their place and has named each one, brethren. Honey, listen, if it wasn't for sin, Brother Terry, this would be a wonderful place. But honey, listen, when, when Adam sinned in the garden, honey, I believe their hearts were darkened in that day. Honey, I want you to know when he transgressed against God, listen, I want you to know that that separated him from his heavenly father. And I believe that the glory he had in the garden 
was lost in that day, Brother Terry. But honey, listen, I'm glad that God had a plan, Brother Marty. I'm glad that God had a plan before the foundation of the world. He knew that man would sin in the garden, but he had another man set aside. Brethren, and his name was Jesus Christ. Amen. And he was ordained before the foundation of the world to come down to this low ground of sorrow and to be the first fruit of many brethren. Honey, I want Amen. you to know this morning that he came as Brother Terry said, to do one thing. And he came to take the sin of the whole world and nail them to the cross. Honey, listen, when Adam sinned, honey, we're all just multiplied Adams, honey. We've Amen. all, we have the same sin today as he had in the garden. Honey, we've all been shaping, born in sin, shaping in iniquity. I remember, Brother Terry, when there was a time in my life when I was just as good as I could have ever been in God's eyes, the law had never come down into my heart, Brother Terry. I was pure and undefiled, but there come a day when I knew to do good and I did it not. And honey, listen, I want you to know that my sins had separated me from God. And I can almost take you to the day, Brother Marty. Seemed like there was just a dark cloud come up on me, Brother Terry. Honey, listen, I want you to know that, but I'm thankful that God come down, brethren, God come down right down in the flesh. He was born of a virgin now, brothers and sisters. He sure was born of a virgin, mm -hmm. honey, and we don't hear much about him, brother Glenn, from the time he was born up to the time he became 30 years old. But we know at that time that he began to preach that the power and demonstration of the Holy Spirit, he became... He came to preach his own everlasting gospel, That's Brother right. Junior. And I believe, brethren, that he came and he done many good deeds. And I hope you pray. Yeah, the Lord. scripture says that, honey, listen, if the good things and the good deeds that Jesus done had been written in books, the world would not have been able to contain them. Honey, but listen, no doubt, honey, we read, Brother Marty, you pray, we read where he went out. And honey, listen, he caused the lame to walk again, Brother Terry. He opened the eyes of the blind, brethren. Listen, he done many wonderful works. But listen, I want you to know that the reason Jesus came, honey, because there was a hill named Golgotha, and he was bound and he was determined. His eyes was set like a flint, Brother yes, Junior, honey, up on that cross. And <laughs> Brother Terry mentioned about when he was in the Garden of Gethsemane, honey, there became a time, honey, when he became so burdened down that his sweat became as great drops yes. of blood, Brother yes. Terry. Honey, and this scripture says, that being in an agony, he began to pray more fervently. Honey, but there was an angel, I believe, Brother Terry, come down from heaven, brother, and ministered to Jesus right there in the garden. And the scripture said it strengthened him, Brother Marty. Honey, listen, it gave him strength to go a little further. Do you think Jesus was a walking by faith this morning, Brother Marty? Yes, sir, he was a walking by faith. Honey, listen, he knew that there was a cross awaiting on him. He knew, Brother that he was going to have to suffer a horrible death, honey, but he was willing to do these things. And I'm glad, Brother Marty, that not only was he willing to take not only a, the scourging and the beatings, honey, but most importantly, he, he wanted to take our sins away from us, brethren. I'm glad this, this evening, honey, that, listen, Jesus had his eyes set on the cross, I'm glad that he's seen all of mankind and he knew that we were lost, ruined, and undone. Brother Terry had no hope to get back to the tree of life. Honey, listen, when Adam and Eve was drove out of the garden, honey, there was two cherubims set at the east end of the garden, honey, to prevent them from coming back and getting back and taking hold of the tree of life, Brother Terry. Honey, and if Jesus had not come, we'd have been lost in our sins. We'd have not been able to take hold of that tree of life. But honey, I'm glad for that precious blood that came down and was shed up on the old cross. Brethren, and listen, I want you to know, brother, brother Terry, as you spoke, there was a bitter cup there, brethren, the bitter cup of sin, brethren. And he asked his father, said, Father, if it be thy will, let this cup pass from me, but nevertheless, thy will be done. Heavenly Father, oh, I'm so glad that he came to do the will of his father, Brother Marty. Honey, listen, I want you to know 
that when he was up on that cross, brethren, he could have called up on the 12 legions of angels to come down and to take him off of that old cross. But that wasn't the plan of God, brethren. He could have cut, those angels could have come down and destroyed every old Jew or every old Roman right there, killed every one of them. But that wasn't the plan, brethren. Honey, it was his plan to come and to be nailed to that old wooden tree, took up on the curse of man. The scripture says, Cursed is every man that hangeth up on a tree. And he took up on the curse, Brother Terry, that it fell up on us. He took it all to the tree, brethren. And if you fail to look to that tree and to the Lord Jesus Christ, if you fail to repent of your sins, you will die lost in your sins and you will die and you will be cast into a lake of fire. But Brother Terry, I'm glad, honey, that I've escaped that wrath, honey. Listen, I'm glad that a long time ago when God spoke to me and let me understand I was lost, ruined, and undone, honey, that I became sorrowful for my sins. Honey, I sure did, honey, and there became there came a day, honey, when I fell down in sackcloth and ashes, and I cried out unto the Lord, save me or I perish. Honey, I had a broken heart, brethren, because of sin, Brother Terry. I had a broken heart. Honey, there was a travail for me. I resisted God for many years. Honey, it was my fault because I wasn't saved. It wasn't God's fault. It's not His will that any should perish but that all should come to repentance. Amen. Honey, but listen, when you hear that small, still voice speaking to you, honey, that is the time, the only time that you can repent of your sins. Honey, listen, this, this was... This, the plan of God was ordained before the foundation of the world. Honey, this book was here before we were, and it'll be here after we're gone, Brother Marty. Honey, listen, God's word has been settled in heaven. It's the same yesterday, today, and forever. It's unchangeable, brethren. My son will have to come in. The same way I did, he'll. I can't bring him, nope. jerk him in by the hand, brethren. He'll have to be led by the Spirit, Sister Janice. The same way that every man and woman has ever been born again by the Spirit of God, honey. But let's get back to that old tree, honey. I want you to know there was a time when Jesus hung on the old tree, and I believe, brethren, the Scripture says that He hung between the heavens and the earth, honey. Listen, and the sin of the whole world fell right down upon him. And the scripture said he bore it, brother. He bore the sins of the whole world. He sure did. Honey, and he done it, Brother Terry, for you and for me this morning. Honey, listen, and I'm glad. Listen, it doesn't matter what nation, kindred, and tongue you are this morning. You may have red skin, yellow skin, black skin, white skin. It doesn't matter, brother. God looks at the heart this evening. Honey, listen, I want you to know there's been many men and the women, honey, that in the eyes of the world, Brother Terry, they don't mean a lot to them. But the most Christ-like people I ever seen growing up were bibbed over holes and didn't have $100 in the bank. But, honey, I would have trusted them with my life because they walk the walk, brother. Honey, listen, you may not have much in the world. There may be a little prostitute down here under the bridge that's been saved. There might be someone down here, an old beggar man, that ain't got nothing but an old buggy pushing around. Honey, but if he's got salvation, he's got more than you. If you've got a mansion up on the hill and you've never been born again, honey, you're poorer than that man is. Right. Honey, we're going to give up the ghost one of these days, Brother Junior. Right. Just like Jesus did, honey. And listen, when you die here in this world, honey, there is no device in the grave in which you can work, honey. You've got to be born again here in this present world in order to achieve heaven. Honey, I want you to know, honey, listen, when Jesus shed that blood, honey, there came a moment, brother, and as I said, that sin of the whole world come right down on him. But brother, now I don't think it was very long that he said, Father, forgive them, for they know not what they do. And he gave up the ghost, Brother Terry. And I believe when he gave up the ghost, brother, and I believe right there, he said it was finished. He said the price back to the tree of life had been 
paid, the wrath of God had been satisfied by the blood of his own son. The scripture says that he gave his blood as an offering for our sins. Honey, I want you to know that blood is precious this morning. And it's not lost any power. But honey, let's go just a little further and I'll get out of the way. In that third and appointed day, brethren, listen, he lay in the heart of the earth. Honey, but I believe God spoke to him, Brother Terry. And I believe, brethren, that he rose from that old tomb, Brother Marty. Yep. They, they, they were some angels that come and rolled that old stone away. Yeah. But it wasn't for him to get out, Brother Junior. Right. He was already out, Brother. Right. It was for everybody to look in and see that he had arisen, Brother. And listen, he's arose for our justification, Amen. Brother. And if you've been born again, we're justified by faith. And we have peace with our Heavenly Father. I've got a peace, Brother Terry. Amen. I've got a peace yes, right here in this world yes, where everything in the world is going on and everybody's running to and fro, worried to death yeah. about everything. Brother Marty, I ain't worried about none of it. Yeah. And because one of these days, listen, Brother Terry talked about Brother John. Listen, that old brother's gone home to his reward now. Yeah. He is in paradise right now rejoicing. His body is soon going to be laid out here in the grave, but he'll not know one thing about it. His soul, his spirit went back to God to give it, and his soul is in his long home. It's in paradise right now, right. Brother Junior. And he's a rejoicing, and he wouldn't come back, Brother Terry, if he could. I believe that. Do you, do you ask me, do I believe it? Absolutely, and this book will back it up. Honey, honey listen, but there's a better day coming. Because on, on the day of the Lord, Brother Marty, God's going to come back in the eastern sky and it's going to roll back like a scroll and he's going to speak. And there's going to be a trump, his voice. He's going to call out unto the ones that have been born again. So the born again going to rise first, Brother Terry. And he listened and I believe we're going to meet him in the clouds and the air, brother, and the ones that's been born again, Sister Janice. Honey, and he's going to take us right on home. This will not have to worry about the wrath that's going to be poured out here. This earth, as Brother Terry spoke, is going to burn with a fervent heat. He, the scripture says even the very elements will melt. I mean, there ain't going to be nothing left here. You're, and you're, if you've never been born again, this world is going to be the best world that you've ever known. So listen, there's a heaven to gain and a hell to shine. But God has given you a decision to let you choose whom you're going to serve. If you serve Satan upon the Earth, honey, that's who you're going to spend eternity with mm -hmm. is in the in the lake of fire. But honey, listen, if you're born again and, and that blood has been is your covering, honey, listen, you've got a home in heaven that's undefiled, that fadeth not away, Brother Glenn. And honey, listen, that's where I'm a going. <laughs> and I want you to go. I want everybody to go. So it's up to you. So you make that choice in whom you're going to serve. Thank you for praying. I brother. enjoy it. Thank uh, you for praying. Well, I tell you, I, I like good preaching, brother. That's good preaching. I, guess. I like the old time. Mm -hmm. Continue preaching. the revelation best. preaching. It ain't about something we made up or something. No, no. sir. And uh, I pray that it's my goodness. Continue the Lord, yes, yes, our just good time, to the Lord, I pray. You know, <coughs> we're just men. Yes. Oh, we are. We, uh, God calls us and gives us a gift, and we've got to work in that gift. And he us to use it. Amen, to brother. Do the best we can. You yes. Know? So I'm willing to spin and be spent. Bless your heart, brother. Across. Yeah, bless my brother. I've been in this race for a while, and I never get tired of, uh, of the Spirit of the Lord. I always love to feel the Spirit of the Lord, feel the power of God moving in our lives. We feel this wonderful spirit yes. that he gives us to have and we can witness to the world and let them see mm -hmm. that there's reality in serving the Lord. Yes, amen. Help him, Lord, I pray.
Sunder the joint and the mar. Yes. And it is a discerner of the heart and the intents of the mind. God searches the deep things, yea, even the hidden things of man. Thank you. Who can know the heart? It is desperately wicked. Who can know it? Only God searches the heart and knows the mind and our thoughts Thank afar you, off. We pray. 
No God like our God. He is a God that is at hand and he's not went on a journey. Amen. In this world of trials and tribulations that we live in today, people is a searching for something to find peace. They're searching for riches and they're searching for gold and silver, mm -hmm. but they can't find peace. Nope. Some has millions and mm. maybe billions of dollars. They have fine homes and cars and all the things of this world. Miserable. And they're miserable in their yes. life. Yes. Because there's a void in there. They, when they sinned against God and God left them. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you today, it's a dark and a cold place that you're living in. Amen. And there's the brother and his priest, salvation, all so wonderful today. <laughs> telling you about a man called Jesus, the only oh, way of the God. truth. And the life, and the only way from this earth unto the glory world. I'm still the day the same one that God picked out of the mar and the clay and set me on that rock and established my going and put a new song in my mouth. I am the one that God, brethren, heard my cry when I was in that desperate place, in a place of darkness, in a place of coldness. A place of loneliness where that it was no peace. Yeah. In the world you shall have trials and tribulation. Uh, but Jesus yeah. said in me you may have peace. Yeah. Uh, uh, so yeah. if you're here listen today. A uh, uh, sinner man you're it's looking for peace. Uh, or maybe if you've been born again. I want you to know today, uh, uh, listen, the only peace there is, uh, is the peace of God that surpasses all understanding. I, I love friend, uh, and there's only one way that you uh, uh, can get that peace uh, uh, by being born again. Uh, uh, listen today, Jesus, for this call uh, uh, came I into the world to this end. He said, when I born, uh, oh, brother, uh, all things I uh, was by the law uh, of the shedding of the blood, brethren, without, uh, uh, that without the shedding of the blood, there'd have been no uh, uh, remission of sin. And I, I see, brethren, down uh, and in the law where uh, uh, the high priest had to go into the holiest of the holy. Uh, uh, oh, not for his own sin, uh, but for the sin of the people. And, uh, and he go in once a year, brethren, uh, uh, listen to the holiest of the holy uh, uh, where only the high priest uh, uh, was allowed to go into. Uh, uh, there was many priests working uh, in, in the tabernacle, brother. Uh, uh, we got many workers in the, in the vineyard today. Uh, uh, oh, but there was only one uh, uh, that was in her, uh, was able to enter into the holiest of the holy. Uh, uh, what was in there, my brother? Uh, uh, the glory of God was in that play. Uh, uh, oh, brother. Uh, and there, there, in that play uh, 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 was uh, uh, this little ark, brother. And in that ark, uh, uh, there was the tablet, uh, and there was the rod uh, uh, that Aaron did budded, brother. Uh, yes, it was an old dry stick and budded, brother. Uh, uh, you think about this, Jesus said, uh, if you do this uh, in a green tree, what shall be done in a dry? Uh, uh, oh, brother. Uh, and in the town, this little uh, uh, art, brother, uh, uh, listen, on, uh, on the top of him, uh, uh, there was two angels, brother, uh, and their angel and the wings uh, uh, overshadowed this little art, uh, and brother, they turned, uh, and brother, when the high priest would come in there, uh, uh, oh, the glory of God, brother, uh, would come into that place where uh, he tang uh, of the blood. Uh, uh, listen, he anoint the horns of the altar. Uh, uh, I want you to know that, hey, brethren, uh, uh, he was a uh, uh, type and a fear uh, of things to come. Uh, and there was none worthy. Uh, only the high priest could go bring to that. Uh, uh, oh, oh, brother, here's what I love about the altar. Yeah, uh, uh, down yeah. in the altar. 
of an overshadowed it was the mercy uh, seat, brother. Uh, uh, bless that mercy seat today. Uh, what would you have been without mercy? Uh, uh, the law couldn't get lie, uh, or barely righteousness would have came by the law. Uh, the law came by Moses, uh, the grace and truth uh, came by Jesus Christ. Uh, uh, listen today, uh, uh, and the old uh, uh, priest brethren uh, uh, would go in there in the glory of God. Uh, uh, when he would come out of there, uh, uh, no doubt his face would shine. Uh, uh, no doubt uh, I could see the glory of God uh, upon the children of God. Uh, uh, when the Spirit is on them, uh, uh, the tree will close and uh, uh, it, will, it will begin to glisten, brother. Uh, it will begin to burn uh, as it did on the mountain. Uh, uh, listen, when Moses was on the mountain, uh, uh, the tree would burn, uh, uh, but it didn't be consumed. Amen. Oh, brother. Uh, but the old man of God is a preaching the word, uh, and the word of God is going out. Uh, there's a fire of burning. Uh, 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 listen today. Uh, oh, friend, today. Uh, uh, but here's the thing I want to get on your mind this morning. Uh, uh, there was a man. Uh, and down there, uh, uh, listen, uh, uh, was made uh, yeah. after the murder of Melchizedek, yeah. uh, uh, the high priest, uh, uh, listen, having neither beginning of days uh, <laughs> or in the life, having neither mother and or father uh, yeah. uh, listen today uh, uh, brother he was God brother uh, if I know anything Amen. about it uh, uh, he was Jesus Christ himself uh, uh, oh brother uh, and here in the process of time uh, we needed one to go into the holiest of the holy uh, oh listen uh, the only one that yes. had the power the only one that was ever found worthy in heaven and the earth uh, or beneath the earth to open the book uh, and to loose the seals thereof uh, of this holy Lamb of God, uh, of this high priest, brother, uh, uh, that was made after the order of Melchizedek. Uh, uh, Jesus was a prophet. Uh, he was a priest. Uh, uh, he was a king, brother. Uh, uh, he was all in one and one. Uh, uh, bro On that old rugged crown when he died, brother, and I, uh, uh, listen, he give up the gold. Uh, uh, the Bible said uh, uh, that the, the the veil of the temple uh, uh, rent from the top to the bottom. Uh, uh, brother, when the blood uh, uh, come down, uh, it broke down the wall uh, between the Jew hey, and the Gentile. Hey. Uh, we didn't have a right to that blood, oh, brother. Yeah. Uh, oh, but Jesus said, uh, because I uh, ye can live also uh, because uh, uh, listen he is God uh, uh, he was able to offer him uh, uh, the sacrifice uh, the priest had to go in once a year uh, uh, Jesus Christ once uh, and forever uh, uh, made the offering brother yeah. to God uh, he offered One himself time. without spot uh, uh, without blaming uh, oh uh, taking our sin uh, and never Sacrificed himself uh, yeah. that you and I could have life uh, and have it more abundantly. Yeah. Uh, and Jesus, Brother King, uh, uh, when he rose, he said, Because I live, uh, oh, uh, he can live also. Uh, how long is he alive for? Oh, God. Uh, oh John, uh, and behold, John, I'm he that was dead. Uh, but behold, I'm alive, uh, and I'm alive forevermore. I've got the keys, John. Uh, yeah. uh, death and hell. You see, he conquered uh, over death, hell, and the grave. Uh, he conquered it all, friend, today. Uh, and why? Uh, why? Because he loved you. Uh, he loved the, uh, uh, the creation of his hand, brother, uh, uh, that he might uh, and you might have life in him. Uh, uh, oh, he said, I stand all the day long, uh, a crime come unto me. Uh, all ye that labor in heavy laden, uh, uh, take my yoke upon you uh, and learn of me. My yoke is easy, uh, uh, my burden to light, uh, and you shall find rest for your soul. Uh, uh, the sacrifice has already been made, friend. Uh, all you got to do is come uh, and get under the blood uh, of the day. Uh, oh, of the blood of Jesus uh, will 
cleanse you from all sin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It don't matter what you've done. Yeah. Some say, well, now I, I, I stole a little. I told a few lies. I, on oh, some preach that adultery is greater than them. Uh, mm -hmm. Well, I'm going to tell you, friend Paul said, and such was some of you, uh, adulterers and fornicators yeah. and liars and them, uh, yeah. uh, that you've been brought nigh by the blood of the yeah. brother. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, the blood will make you whole. Uh, the blood will make you pure. Uh, the blood will sacrifice. <laughs> and he gave will give you life eternal. Oh, no matter what, all manner of sin, uh, uh, Jesus said, shall uh, uh, be forgiven unto the sons of men, uh, except for blaspheme against the Holy Ghost. Uh, uh, you can even blaspheme the name of Jesus uh, yeah. and still be That's forgiven, friend. Uh, uh, but if you blaspheme the Holy Ghost, uh, saying that the Holy Ghost is an unclean spirit, uh, uh, they're never forgiven us for that sin, friend. Uh, uh, oh, uh, but Jesus don't want you uh, uh, to go down to the word of the Lord. Uh, he wants to come into your house. Uh, he wants to live at your house today. Uh, he wants you to open up the door. Uh, he said, I stand at the door knock. Uh, if any man will open the door, uh, I will come in to him. Uh, I and my father will come in. Uh, uh, we'll sup with him a little bit. Uh, if you ever sup with the Lord, oh, brother, uh, uh, come and taste of me uh, and see that I'm good, brother. I, I find the Lord good to my taste. I, I find the Lord good. I, uh, brother, and he's a present help uh, in the time of trouble. Uh, uh, he is a rock in a weary land, friend. Uh, uh, you're in a troublesome time in this world. Uh, uh, listen, uh, uh, there is troubles on every hand, uh, uh, but in me you might have peace uh, and have it more abundantly, Amen. friend. Uh, uh, oh, Day. Uh, take heed of that light uh, uh, shining in your heart uh, that you might become uh, uh, the children yes. of the light. Uh, and that light is shining today. Uh, uh, take heed to that light, brother. Uh, it's a drawing, man. Uh, and the only way you will ever get to heaven, friend, uh, about obeying from the heart uh, of that doctrine that was already set up uh, uh, by, the pro uh, by the prophets uh, and the apostles uh, and Jesus. Christ yeah. himself uh, uh, being the chief cornerstone brother Terry uh, uh, there are no yeah. other way given under heaven uh, uh, whereby man must be seen uh, except <laughs> going by that name uh, uh, oh where did the name come from uh, out of the very portals of heaven <laughs> brother yeah. he was given a name above the angel uh, yeah. and in the name of Jesus mm -hmm. every, every yeah. knee should bow uh, Every tongue should confess, Brother Terry. Uh, uh, but in that day when the Lord returned, uh, yeah. uh, the great men of the earth uh, and the strong men and all is going to bow in that day. Uh, uh, when the heavens shall roll back as a great scroll, uh, uh, then shall men run to the rocks and the mountain. Uh, they're going to be a trying to find a hiding place. Hey, and, uh, uh, there is no hiding place from the eyes no. of him uh, and whom we have to do. His eyes uh, uh, go to and fro on the earth. Behold it. Uh, uh, both the good and the evil, friend. Uh, uh, God knows where you're at today. Uh, yes, he knows yes. your thoughts today. Uh, yes. He knows where you've been born again or not. Uh, having this seal, he said, the Lord uh, uh, knows them that are high in. Uh, if you've got that blood applied upon you, uh, uh, oh, it'll cover you. Uh, uh, after you heard the word of truth, uh, yes. uh, the gospel of your salvation, yes. and after you believe, yes. then will you be sealed with that Holy Spirit of promise and that blood, brother, and I, uh, that will cleanse you from all sin. Uh, he'll make a new creature out of you. Uh, uh, listen, you'll not be the, the same man that you once was. Uh, he'll make another man out of yes, you. Sir. We, uh, as he did uh, uh, Saul, it was. Yeah. It was uh, he went, he would become another man, brother. Uh, I don't walk the same walk I did uh, uh, when I was in the world. Uh, uh, oh! the same song. I, I love to sing the song to die. The Lord God of heaven, I, I don't want to hang my song upon the willow. Yeah, amen. Oh, but I want to raise up uh, 
uh, the people knees that hang down in the hands uh, uh, brethren and praise his name brethren forever and forever uh, uh, he's worthy today uh, I'm not worthy of no praise and glory uh, no I'm just a man friend uh, I'm just uh, I'm just a dust worm brother yeah. I, I tell him all the time Lord yeah. remember I, I'm just a dust worm <laughs> God I, I, oh God remember I, that I was made from the dust Lord I, but I am what I am uh, by yeah. the grace of God and you are what you are today uh, if you've been born again uh, uh, by that blood that he shed uh, that made an atonement for you yeah. uh, I'm glad the blood is still making atonement uh, uh, for sin <laughs> brother uh, uh, won't you come and get under the covenant uh, he yeah. said in that day shall a man be uh, as a hiding plain uh, and as a rock in a worried <laughs> land yeah. uh, and as a covert from the storm uh, yeah. I'd like to get under the hiding plain <laughs> brother and uh, I Oh, brother, today I'd rather be a tent keeper in the house of the Lord yes. than to dwell in the tents of the wicked. I'm going to tell you, friend, because when the end comes, I, I'm going to hear him say, Come, you blessed to my father, and I inherit the kingdom prepared I, I before the foundation yes. of the world. I, I, oh, bless the kingdom of God, and don't come for observation, yes. but it is within you if you've been born again. Yeah. I'm going to tell you today, I'm not taking much more time that Jesus said, uh, as my Father appoint unto me a kingdom, I will also appoint unto you that you might eat and drink uh, at my table in my kingdom. Uh, uh, what are you eating and drinking today, friend? I, I'm eating and drinking heaven food, hey. brother. I, I, they eat uh, a manna down in the wilderness, uh, and they eat angels' food, uh, hey. and they are dead. I, oh, but Jesus said, I, I'm the bread that come down from God out of heaven. <laughs> Yeah, now, man can eat thereof and never yeah. die. Hey, man. It's an everlasting salvation Jesus has to give. I, I, oh, listen, won't you come one and all I, under the family reunion? We're going to be gathering yeah. uh, uh, from the four corners of the earth. The angels is going to gather his uh, uh, children together one day. Oh, the child of the Lord, uh, the deliverer of the church back to the Father. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Without spot or without wrinkle, <coughs> there is no God like our God. Mm -mm. Friend, the day, the day is the day of salvation. Amen. If you will hear his voice and you won't harden your hearts, God has promised if you'll come before his throne and pray and humble yourself and give him your whole heart. Yep. Yeah. So mind and strength, he said, I'll come in and take up our abode in there. Yes, yes, and I'll Lord. go no more out. I'll, I will be in you. I'm going to tell you, he'll give you a drink of water that will be in you a well of living water. <laughs> yes, sir. And you can drink when you get thirsty. You can draw from the wells of salvation. Yeah. yeah. So today, brother, I've, <clears throat> I've done the best that the Lord has given me what to say. I want you, brother, to come and come to an end. Uh, Anybody got a song on our heart? We are blessed. <laughs>
receive any any natural silver or gold today. No. For all these years, Brother Junior, what a long time that I've been at it and we yeah, somebody's put a dollar worth of gas in our tank every now and then. We appreciate that. But uh, what we receive well, most of all yes, one of the most precious things that I've ever received, Brother Junior, is you're in a center man or want to say so if you got something today mm -hmm. and you're reaching for a payday, oh boy, what? There's mercy, uh -huh. Jesus and mercy. Yes, yes, there there is. Is. You brother got anything to say? You like to say? If not, then, uh, it's been our way, but we've always called it this mission. And I love each and every one of you all here. May God bless you. We're going to look to the Lord and be dismissed in order. Our most kind and gracious Heavenly Father. Yes, Lord. I hate to part, really, to be honest. Not with you, Lord. I hate to leave the little church house, Brother yes, Junior. Lord. It feels good to be here. Yes. I hate to not see my brethren yes. again for a while, Brother Glenn. We're opening that morning. When we wait, we'll see you. As we've never seen before. Oh, Lord. You talk about 2020 vision. It can't even compare to that morning. Yeah, we have it. It does not yet appear what we'd be like. But we'll know the Bible says we'll be as the angels of heaven. That's a wonderful thing, brethren, to be like the angels of heaven. We ask you, God, that you bless this service wherever it may go for your intended purpose, Lord. Bless the sick and needy, the bereaved families. Comfort our broken hearts today. Mm -hmm. And as we travel through this world, let us shine the light for thee, yeah, wherever we may go, God. And with the <coughs> remainder of this day, God, would you let us do with it that would be pleasing to thee. Yes. Father, go with Brother Junior, Lord, as he travels. Yeah. Well, God, Father, oh. if there be any trouble in front of him, would you remove it from him and Brother Marty and all yeah. of us that travel, Lord. Yes, Lord. Now go with us, Lord, to the remainder of this life. In the end, Lord, call us home to heaven where we'll be able more qualified to give you the praise in the world that will never end. Yes. 
the things I've been neglectful of asking, not knowing all things, through the weakness of the flesh, would you grant in thy great and mighty wisdom, most of all, thy sweet and divine love. Dismiss in this place, but not from thy love, Terry keeping. In Christ's name we pray. Amen. And amen. 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 Been good we've been here, brother. Yes. Been good, brother. And I felt the Lord, brother. Mark. I, I felt him. You, and I know that he's alive, that he's alive forevermore. Somebody said he's dead. No, he's not dead, brother. No, no, no. 